I always say alerts, it is me, Jimmy, and on this episode of Pest Foodie, we're gonna be making seared salmon with blood orange glazed carrots. It is very simple and easy, yet still looks and tastes amazing. So let's go ahead and start cooking up. First things first, I have a few carrots which I'm going to peel and cut in a uniform shape. Doesn't matter what it is as long as they're all the same size so they cook evenly together. Over here I have a big old piece of salmon which I'm going to be cutting into fillets. The salmon should be completely dry before we season it, so go ahead and pat it dry with some paper towel. The next step is to season the salmon with a good amount of salt and pepper. And giving it a fair massage to let the seasoning stick to it. Now over a medium high heat I have melted some butter and to that we're adding the carrots to saute for three to four minutes or until it gets a golden brown color around the edges also known as caramelization. Don't forget to season the carrots with salt as well. So when that happens go ahead and add some vinegar. Now here I'm using a red fruit vinegar which is very tasty and provides some flavors that complement this side dish. Let the vinegar reduce for 1-2 to two minutes, then add in some honey. And some blood orange juice. After we season with some pepper, let that reduce on medium-low heat for 5 minutes. And in the meantime, we're gonna start searing the salmon. So in a skillet on high heat, I have just a couple teaspoons of olive oil. Now we want to wait for the oil to get smoking hot. So once it does, we're gonna put the salmon skin side up and sear it off for four to five minutes, then flip it over and continue cooking for a further two to three minutes or until it's lovely and flaky. And other than checking your carrots for seasoning, you are pretty much done. Plate it up and enjoy. This is very simple to prepare and barely takes any time at all. And anybody can pull it off, really. It's impressive and delicious, and you must give it a try. Send me pictures on Twitter and Instagram, and don't forget to subscribe. And I'll see you sailors on the next cruise.